Hi everyone, I hope you're all well and survived the solar eclipse today. It was a powerful one. And solar eclipses always come to dissolve energy blocks within us. So if anything is coming up, any emotions, if you're feeling tired, rest. Allow the light to dissolve any emotions that are coming up, knowing that it's all good. We have come through the lunar eclipse, now the solar eclipse, so a lot of energy and we're moving into the solstice. So lots of energy shifts going on within us. The planets above are moving and shifting, so that shifts anything that we may be holding on to within us as well. So as above, so below, as within, so without. So take some time rest just let yourself integrate this energy that's this downpouring of energy that's um been occurring allow it to activate within your body and when it starts to activate it shifts stuff really quick that is no longer serving us and sometimes we can start wrestling with those old emotions and thoughts and it's now just relax take a step back there's no rush for anything at this time take your time don't let your head take you in and make and and take you into a place of impatience just rest everything will come everything is is coming to us and we're shifting through this energy and it is to be flexible don't have something concrete in your head and expectations be flexible and, and move your way through these energies allow your your body to flow don't get caught up in your head be aware of any charges that come up at this time so if anything over the the last few weeks has been uh, has come up and not yet out of alignment know that the 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 divine is showing you that you're holding on to this inside and whatever we have inside we will it will be caught up in our manifestations so use this time to really cultivate i'm coming to archangel uh the angel tarot card deck uh Radley valentine's angel tarot card deck for a message for us all to help guide us through these energies we have Archangel Raphael stepping forward and so just take some nice deep breaths and just breathe the emerald light in of Archangel Raphael just to dissolve anything that that is coming up that's no longer serving our eyes God allow it to be dissolved into the emerald light Archangel Raphael and also lots of spirit animals are making themselves known during this time so watch for any spirit animal making its showing itself to you any animal that comes to you more than three times whether it's in your third eye or, make, or on a picture or keeps showing itself on the TV whatever it is that that spirit animal is is coming to you to help you on your path so be aware of that occurring at this time so i'm asking the angels for a message for the collective for us all a general reading to help us to see the energy with clarity instead of getting all disorientated with anything that might be coming up within us there we go so i'm asking for a message for us all so we have the first one is three of air so this is a time to heal we, we're coming through so many shifts that the planets in the, above uh, in the cosmos are really moving about there and, and and it does start to shift things within so be gentle with yourself during this time do yourself healing drinking water holding water because water holds memory is sacred drinking more water at this time infusing it with love treating water with respect and putting it in a, a nice water vessel and placing it out to take up all the energies that are, are downpouring into earth at this time so use your tools that you have to do your own healing be gentle with yourself don't go rushing in 
with impatience or saying anything that is coming from emotion at this time because we're all going through these shifts together the whole planet is and this energy is going to take six months so up to Christmas these energies are going to be just coming through and, and bringing to light anything that we need to really dissolve and, and to love ourselves a little bit extra so this card is time to heal from sadness so look at any uh, any areas of your life where there is sadness and and just call archangel azriel in archangel azriel helps us to go through these transitions and but the planet is going through massive transitions at this time so call in archangel azriel to help with any transitions that are occurring in your life at this time whether you're stepping onto a new path or whether there, there is things going on with your loved ones, call in Archangel Azrael. And have, be gentle with yourself. Don't put any expectations on yourself or anybody else at this time. Remembering that we're all on our own soul journey. And when we put expectation and we're trying to control somebody else's soul journey, we become we become really out of alignment, we become sad, we become uh, exhausted. So let go of any control, just sit, just rest at this time, allow all this energy to integrate into your body. If we had been going circuit training, we would, we would need a rest after. And this is exactly what the energies have been doing we're being bombarded with all this light with all this divine intelligence coming in to uh, and moving out now and lifetimes of belief that are no longer serving us we're evolving now and to evolve we have to move through this energy flow through it not not start going into resistance with it the five of earth so surrounding any fears that you have at all the light will bring it bring them and if we want to believe in those fears we are just going to create bothersome bothersome problems on our path the, the angels are saying let go of those fears everything financially we will be looked after so don't go into worry over finances remembering that whatever whatever we start to the energy we place onto something that is what we start to create even if it's not happening if we see a problem if we we look at in the future of not having enough then we are holding ourselves in a lower vibration of of no faith when we look at and know that in this moment feeling the abundance flow into you how wonderful that will feel and feel the energy of that at the peace of mind of it the happiness the the joy that it brings of being secure and and feeling those energies and knowing that the divine will always support us the, our soul is guiding us we're exactly where it has to go for the soul learning so let go of any fears the fears are what can contract us hold us still when we let go and know that and allow things to flow and feel excited about life and allow everybody else to have their own understandings and their own ways of seeing things without trying to project everything that we see onto them allow them to to grow in their own way and take our control away from that because if we try and control that if we if we try and make sure everybody else is okay we come out of the true essence of who we are when we bring ourselves into that pureness of understanding and that faith that 
everything is happening in divine order which in truth it is and let anything else dissolve into the light and the five of water things not turning out the way that we think they should do so these cards are really making us look at the, our shadow side because even though the five of water the five of cups as some you know cups turned over it still has two cups which is the two of cups in the cup um suit are relationships and and celebration a beautiful relationship coming together don't don't be looking at missed opportunities or how you you would be if things were better in your life because ultimately it's our belief that creates our life so the five of water is reminding us not all our cups are turned over there's two there full to the brim which is relationship and, and a beautiful relationship coming together don't be looking into scarcity in your life don't be looking into what's missing in your life look at the power of who you are the power of you being your own creator and coming from that place of creating when we sit in peace we are going to create peace when we sit in harmony we will create harmony and allowing anything else that is no longer serving our highest good to just dissolve into the light now so take some nice deep breaths and allow anything that may be presenting itself to you at this time that is robbing you of happiness there is robbing you of harmony it's only our own minds that do that so take some nice deep breaths and just breathe your beautiful healing light in from your higher self your higher self knows the way breathe the light in from your higher self who is at peace who is in joy who is in full health breathe that energy in into every cell of your body and feel yourself come into alignment feel all your chakras come into alignment now with your eye self integrating all this powerful mystical divine intelligence into every cell of our body and letting go of anything else knowing that we are guided every second and we have got at the bottom of the deck the ace of air new opportunities come in brilliant ideas start to drop in through our crown the moment we stop worrying and looking at what we've not got these beautiful ideas are, and this is what this energy is it's dropping golden nuggets in through our crowns and these golden nuggets are beautiful ideas that expand us and the air cards are all about thoughts so cultivate your thoughts now don't be thinking over these same old, same old, trying to fix things. Let it go. Allow these beautiful new ideas, these beautiful new opportunities to drop in now. And take one step at a time. Don't rush into anything. Allow it to integrate. When these ideas come in and they expand and they uplift, and then then all the, everything that you need to, to bring this, these, thoughts into and hanker them into your reality all the opportunities start to come into alignment so this is the past this is what this light shifted this is what this this activation is is shifting and dissolving ready for the new path we're all walking through different on we were all traveling through different timelines there's so many realities you only have to listen to one friend and then another to 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 understand everybody is in on a different timeline and allow them to be on that it's their soul journey and this is our soul journey stay focused on where it is your vision stay focused there let let go of everybody else's interpretation of what's going on the truth will be shown the divine truth will always show itself 
just have patience, step back, know the truth of what's right for you. What is good for somebody else, that's fine. Listen to what's right for you. And if you're being led through fear or you're being, you're being rushed into something, take a step back. Take a step back and just wait until everything comes in alignment and these beautiful opportunities start to show up on your path. I'm sending so much love and angel blessings and really do yourself healing, allow this energy to integrate lots of rest, lots of rest during this time. Remembering energetically we are working really hard. We are we are using everything. All our chakras are, are shifting. We are moving up through these dimensions. We're we're tapping into different frequencies now tap into those frequencies that bring you joy that uplift you that give you freedom i'm sending so much love and angel blessings and healing to anybody at this time who is going through these shifts they are they can seem real at the time we're not going to stay in these they will pass and better um better things are coming in so I'm sending so much love and healing and thank you, thank you, thank you so much for listening to me. I really appreciate that. Thank you. God bless.